Hi friends, this is my 12th video lecture on expert advisors. In this video, I'll be talking about the if else if statement. Okay, previously we have studied if and else statement, but in this um, video, I'll be talking about if you have more than one conditions and you have to do uh, be, uh, you have to make a decision based on those um, conditions what you what you will be going to do for example um, if we have uh, two variables uh, we can have three um, three relations between them either a is equal equals to b a is less than b or a is greater than b these three conditions um, are possible um, between two variables so in this uh, um, if else statement we can um, only test <coughs> whether a condition is true if the condition is true we run uh, we execute a piece of code written um, inside the body of if and if that condition is not true we execute the piece of code which is written inside the else statement what about the other um, the other two uh, conditions which can uh, hold between these two variables so we are going to do it in this uh, lecture and for doing that um, we use if else if um, statement if else if statement is written like that if this condition is true we execute this piece of code and for the next condition we uh, write for the next condition we um, change the if statement with this statement which is called else if statement if a equals to b we wanted to execute this piece of code and we wanted to write like a is exactly equals to b and by doing this we can put a hundred uh, conditions um, below this piece of code and we continue writing else ifs if we have more than one conditions alerts mm. a is less than b and finally we can use a else statement in the end and which can alert us um, well this uh, can never be called but even then we can write something in it okay so compile it and let's see what we get a is less than b unlike previous um, previous lecture in this lecture we can uh, we have we are testing all the three conditions which can be possible within two variables and based on these uh, three conditions uh, we can make our decisions and we can um, do certain tasks like that <coughs> let's do um, a practical example and based on the based on these uh, the values let's make a variable called double and let's uh, set its price to price is a variable name and let's um, make it like uh, 1.5656 1.56565 okay and 
let's <coughs> make the EA um, which uh, continue executing on the chart um, and tells us whether the current price is greater than the price um, written here or it's less than or it's equal to the price so let's do it <coughs> the current ask and bid prices uh, can be extracted from the market by writing ask or bid directly onto the chart onto the code there are built in variables and they return us the current ask and the current bid price of the um, of the currency home the expert is attached to for example uh, here expert advisor is attached to um, pound dollar h1 time frame chart and it will return us the current ask price of uh, of this currency if uh, we will attach the expert advisor to this chart and if we will uh, attach the chart uh, to other uh, um, currencies it will um, return us their ask or bid um, price whatever we wanted to um, whatever we wanted to know about them so let's test our condition like if ask the ask price of of the chart which this expert is attached to is greater than the price we have just um, set it above here it should alert us it should alert us the price the price has moved up <coughs> um, the price has moved up and if else if if the ask is exactly equals to the price it should alert us price the um, current market price equals the price we have chosen and the third condition if ask is um, less than the price it should alert us the current market value is below the ask is below the um, price we have chosen okay now and you know this start function executed is executed whenever a new price uh, whenever a new tick arrives for example this is 1.56375 and we and now this is seven seven and seven eight whenever the new value arrives this uh, function instantly executed